thousands. Even Marty, the degenerate, who's an alcoholic by 12. Uncle Donald, he hands me this shiny wee box. It's going on and on. Open it, boy, open it. You'll love the surprise. Thing is, I already know that it's a major Howl action figure. I was a nosy bastard. So, I open it up. I look right at my uncle and act surprised. He sees right through me. <laughs> right? Out of nowhere, Uncle Donny grabs Major Howells and he kicks him out the goddamn door! Oh, shit! Room goes dead quiet. Uncle Donny just trucks. Got to surprise the boy on his birthday. <laughs> Was there a point to your story? Surprises. They fill me with dread and anxiety. Getting bumpy out there, team. Might want to buckle in. What the hell? Scratch that. Strap your shoots on. I ain't stopping on the island, but this storm might have other plans. Off to a promising start, eh? Oh, shit! <laughs> Signal, though. Could be the others. Where the hell am I? Huh? The hell is that stench? <laughs> Bringing up some bad memories. Need to get out of here. Anybody there? Lieutenant Kalisto reporting for duty, sir. Glad you made it, soldier. You good? <laughs> Bit banged up, but I'll survive. Any sign of the outsider? Negative. Kid! You out there? Reunited at last! You made it. Well, thanks to you, Cog. Goddamn mania kicking me out of a burning plane. Well, outsider, seems like I should get a thank you, seeing as you're alive. You're assuming I want to be alive. <laughs> <clears throat> Teams back together. Now what? You all follow the beacon, right? Let's find a way up to it. <laughs> hey, 
This looks like a good way out. Come on. Charge know we survive. Only way to do that is locate the crash site. Hope that radio is intact. I saw the condor go down. That quite a trail of smoke. Follow the smoke then. Resupply on me. Great. Now what? Bath ends at this pit here. Oh, real observant there, aren't you? Let's find a way across. Hey, that tree looks unstable. Okay, but how do we knock it down? Could try crawling through there. Looks pretty narrow. Uh, this looks like a way through, but, uh, hmm. Problem, sir? The back isn't what it used to be. Especially after that crash. Leave it to me, sir. Just need a moment. That dead tree's caught on some vines. Let's go. Bit of a ways down, huh? You got a problem with heights? <laughs> After what we've been through, can you blame me? This looks like the way through here. So, either you know our destination before we left? They didn't tell me shit. All I know is there was ocean beneath us a long time. That. Another reason to find that radio ASAP. Well, that is one fucked up plan. There's no way that radio's operational. We need to eliminate it as an option before we move on to another plan. Come on. Look down there. These ruins. I've seen something like them before. My grandmother left the Galante Islands when she was young. But, Boda, from this place. Hell of a way to reconnect with your roots. Must have flown off the plane. <laughs> Thank goodness. Now we're talking. My dad always told me I was lucky. Lucky as a locust in long pants, he'd say. So that's why you were picked for the mission. Back up. You can never be too prepared for what's coming. Hey, little help. I hate this place more by the minute. You were saying something about luck, boy? Hey, we're safe, right? Look, some more supplies. I told ya, lucky. What the fuck? A block! Huh, I stand corrected. How the hell did the swarm get to an island? Sign of the times, old man. The entire world is infected with them. Keep pushing through. Gotta get out of this swamp. It's dropping leeches! In the water. Ready to have some idea about the mission. We must be the first wave of troops to send it in. Two soldiers and a driver isn't exactly what I call a wave. You're a driver. Delivery driver. Award winning. It's John! Get out of the way! <laughs> We're clear! The swarm is 
is even tougher than the locusts. Well, old man, I for one like our odds. Won't be long before the flock's back. Let's go. Look at all this. Now we stand a fighting chance. Do you even know how to use half this ordinance? Sure do, Grandpa. My dad taught me to shoot. Ah, you don't like that thing. You're quite similar. Soldier? Asshole. We're clear. What's next, sir? Stick to the plan. Find the wreckage. Find the radius. There's gotta be a way through here somewhere. Aye. Fucking swarm. Great. They're blocked. We need to look around. There'll be another way to get to that condor. There's a way through here. <clears throat> Someone give me a hand. Looks like the tail end. With any luck, the cockpit and radio is up ahead. Hey, lucky. Remember? The cockpit's on the other side of the door. Let's go. Ah, oh. oh, damn it. Guess the radio's not here. The entire cockpit ain't here, Grabs. So what's the plan if we find that precious radio smashed to pieces? There's a good chance that whoever organized this operation is well aware of what's happened. Might take a while, but they'll send someone. They died in a crash as well. How are your survival skills? Terrible. Delivery driver, remember? Whatever it is they're up to, we need to clear the beach before we find that radio. Good work. Now let's find that radio. This thing is absolutely destroyed. Nice. The radio. It survived. Sounds like the transponder's right. I'll take a look. I think I've got it. Ow. Hey, you still there? Oh, you made it. This is Zach. I'm here to get you. Got a location? On it. Why do we get the feeling that Tack isn't the only one we signal? You and every swarm on the island, brother!
This island could get fucked. Glad to be getting far away from this nightmare. Here's the results. Right. Sorry to be late and all. We survived a horrific condor crash, fought an endless horde of monsters from hell, and barely escaped with our lives. But uh, how's your day been? Well, it's about goddamn time. Holy shit. What? Show some respect. It's Colonel Victor Hoffman. It's an honor, sir. A real hell of an honor. Shared sentiment, soldier. That's why you're here. Best of the best. This here's Hannah Cole. She's my number one on this covert operation. She knows a lot about science things and uh, is, uh, well, in, in general, quite pleasant to be around. Advanced degrees in biochemistry, toxicology, chemistry, and science things. Thanks, Hoff. Anyway, good to finally meet you. What kind of operation is this? Hannah? Now, what we're looking at is a schematic of the Pahanu Cog Bunker, designation Sanctum. It never served its true purpose, instead becoming a burial site at the end of the Locust War. And now, well, it's a full-blown swarm hive. I need you to infiltrate and plant a chemical bomb at its heart so we can kill them from the inside out. It's a high-risk mission. But if we get this right, we can wipe out those bastards and use what we've learned to save the entire goddamn planet. Now, I've made promises to the COG. And through my people on the mainland, I've made promises to you. Complete the objective, and I will deliver. Questions? Whatever the mission, sir, we're in. What? He's the hell out of retirement. <laughs> well then, what are we waiting for? All right, team. You'll be infiltrating the base from its main entrance. All of our recon efforts indicate it remains fully powered by the thermal reactors. Once inside, you'll need to access the bottom floor. It's 20 levels down, but the elevator system will ease the burden. What kind of recon operation did you run? We sent a few teams of DBs, but lost contact. Truth is, we needed somebody with access. Keegan, you're up. I'm on. Commissioning sequence initiated by Special Operations Officer Corporal Jeremiah Keegan. Welcome to Sanctum. Wait, Corporal? I outrank you? Yeah, it's monster. All right, guys, now that we have access to Sanctum, I'm officially initiating our operation. Control has assigned your team designation as Scorpion. Copy that, Hannah. Scorpio moving in. All arrivals must report in with our Sanctum security officers. Please proceed to the waiting area in an orderly fashion. Security officers. Gotta make sure the right people get in. What exactly does the right do? Sanctum was meant to protect the most important COG citizens. Scholars, politicians, celebrities. And which category did you fit in, Gramps? None of the above. Just a goon working for important people. This is decontamination. There should be a final security checkpoint on the other side. All citizens of Sanctum are required to undergo decontamination protocol before entering the facility. Please step into a chamber to begin. Initiating decontamination. You'd think with how bad the COG was losing the war, they'd be willing to take in any poor soul that survived. 
They'll need to follow protocol. Protocol my ass. <laughs> Decontamination complete. Proceed to the briefing room for further instruction. This is my kind of sanctuary. It's engineered, has uh, systems. There's an order to it. The real confidence. This is where new arrivals would have been processed. After a proper clearance, of course. I should be able to get the system online. Just need a second here. That should do it. So, what happened to you? The volcano powering the thermal generators <clears throat> ended up being too unstable. The whole place was deemed uninhabitable. So, oh, after the war, they turned it into a locust burial site. Warning, biological threat detected. The hell? Something's trying to get through. Defensive positions! Reject! Looks like we found your robots, Hannah. Hannah covered that swarm shit! Damn it! We said TV failed to have a ventilation system in. Never heard that. No end of a cop to try to clean up. Welcome to my life, kid. Oh, right. Uh, that would be the DR water we sent to protect the rest of the Navy. Let's keep moving. Come get your ass. Warning. Further access to authorized personnel only. There should be another terminal around the corner. You're up again, Keegan. On it. Authorization granted. Proceed. <laughs> Who'd have thought my clearance would come in handy all these years later? <laughs> More rejects ahead! Welcome. Here we go! Though we live in uncertain times, sing provides safety and security to you and your family. Without her, while the technicians make ready sanctity for long-term residency, you will find your provision Think we got them all. the left. And how many DBs did you send on me, Con Duty? A few? A lot, actually. Sorry. I know the DBs are making your job difficult, but it proves that we need experienced human soldiers to deal with the swarm. It's what Hoffman's been saying. Damn. Door stuck. Leave it to the superior officer, Corporal. Ha ha ha. Imagine living buried down here for the rest of my life. I'd rather die in the sunshine than live underground. Give me vast open spaces. Good. What the hell was that? Just seismic activity from the volcano. Oh, is, is it just a volcano? That's another brilliant cog idea, isn't it? Throw the last of humanity into a fucking volcano. Anyway, the elevators are on the far side of the main hub. Hannah, we've got an infestation coming up into the hub from below. Damn. The hive is growing faster than we predicted. <laughs> Looks like the infestation has affected the elevators. Oh, is this weak gas bomb going to do the job? Yes. Yes, of course. As long as you deliver the bomb to the center of the hive, it should work. It should work? Enough. Let's get down there. Of range. Wonderful. We need to keep moving. Come on. We've got drones. Looks like a small patrol.
clear. Time to move. The console looks offline. I'll give it a try. No good. Have you tried turning it off and on again? Can we please take this seriously? I'll take a look. So I was thinking, why don't we just drop the bomb down the shaft? Looks like it goes all the way to the bottom. Absolutely not. You heard, Hannah. We deploy the payload to the center of the hive. That's the mission. Access granted. Opening maintenance wing. Opening maintenance wing. Didn't we want thermal control? Huh. Here they come. Watch it! All right. Facing the truth, eh? Warning. Ventilation station temperature exceeds safe operating protocols. Cooling area. Ventilation station now within safe operating temperature. Proceed. Shit! That's done! It's protecting the Zion! Ammo deployed! I'm wounded! Getting out of hand! Fast! But you, maybe. Don't know what they were thinking, sending an outsider down here. Can you two argue up when we get out of this fucking place? Flock!
We barely made it out of that one, and it's only going to get worse. We all know it. We are going to die down here. For what? You're afraid of dying? You should have thought of that before you took this on. Oh, believe me, I'm ready to die. But I want it to count. Supplies you got some sort of death wish. Not a death wish, Lonnie. But when the dust settles, I want to have made a goddamn difference. We're in! Let's go! We will fight our way inch by fucking inch if that's what it takes! We all took this mission to make a difference. And we have our orders, outsider. Now, let's make it count. Look, old man, all I know is I want our sacrifice to matter. Take a look around. We have to face the facts. The way things are going, this will all be for nothing. So, Lonnie, we almost there. Not even close. Uh, we made it this far. We'll find another way down. <laughs> Goddamn cog. Just can't admit defeat, can you? I'm done taking shit from you, boy. <laughs> to hell with the objective. The hell you doing? Making it count, brother. Move! Deadly toxin detected. All personnel must vacate safe. Don't fuck! The gas is taking care of us! It'll kill us too! Keep moving! Deploy it correctly. Walks back! 
On the roof there! There's a lava to drop on it! Locked down! Damn it! We're blocked in! Hey, little help? Let me give you a hand there. More precisely, a grenade. Clear! Nice! We're clear! Oh, Max saves the day again! Please hold your applause! They're still riding a goddamn door down a river of lava, thanks to you. Connection! Riding a goddamn door down a river of lava, alive! Thanks to me! Shoot the roof! That's it! Watch it! Trees coming down! Come on, come on, come on! And we're out of here! <laughs> now that's lucky! Oh, everything's a joke to you. Getting by on the skin of your teeth, relying on your luck. You don't have a clue about working with others. Listen, old man, I don't give a sh- Enough! Carry her up ahead! was a failure. Not if we uncovered new data. Anything? The drones, Juvies, roasted them. Heavier swarm. We didn't have the punch we needed. You got anything stronger? Mm. Something that can sink the entire island, maybe. Or how about a few canisters of that nightmare acid that killed all them bastards on the beach, eh? Damn. You might be onto something. I was joking. Even if that could work, there's a problem. We don't know what's responsible for the attack or where to find it. Why, Leahy. My grand used to tell me stories about her people. How the young men and women would travel the ocean to face a god. It was their rite of passage. If anyone knows something about what we saw on the beach, it's my grandmother's people. Well, go then. Make contact. See what you can learn. Hannah. You prep for field work. I want you there to ask the right questions. I'm on it. Let's go, Scorpio. Welcome to Wiley, Scorpio. Once you've propelled in, I'm gonna find a spot nearby. Don't need any more of these last-second rescues. You and me both, Tag. No lava on this island. I like it better already. All right. Let's see if we can learn from the locals. What's the plan with the toxin, Hannah? If we obtain some of that nightmare acid from whatever attacked the swarm on Pahani, we can combine it with the toxin I was sent from New Hope. Hopefully someone here can fill us in on what exactly that acid is and how to get it. We still have to find a better way to the heart of the hive. Yep. I'm working on a solution to that, too. This door, Scorpio. Give me a hand. Huh. Peaceful. Never thought I'd see where my family came from. Even with all the stories and memories she shared. Brad never told me why she left. 
Any of your family still live here? Distant relatives, I'm sure. Guess I should introduce myself. Feels like an odd way to reconnect, you know? Marching in, middle of the night. Oh, I'm sure we'll be given a warm welcome. Not every day a band of armed soldiers want us into town. Well, hopefully they'll be understanding given our rather dire circumstances. Is that... music? Sounds like quite a party. Everyone must be gathered in that hall over there. Couldn't think of a better way to make our entrance. Come on, then. I wonder what they use this space for. Hmm. A workshop? These islands are known for their carvings. Hey! You can't just walk in! Just trying to find the quickest way to the hall. So, Hannah, been meaning to ask. You any relation to the coal trade? Right. Because every coal is related to Augustus. Sorry. Was just curious is all. <laughs> Getting a sense you hear that question more than you'd like to. No, it's okay. I like my dad. I mean... Yes. He's my dad. Just please, please don't ask me about Thrashball. I find it tedious. Augustus this cold. You know I saw him play. That ain't what I remember it for. Man to legend. A true definition of the Cog frontline hero. Yeah, you're not wrong, Keegan. That's what everyone sees in my father. I wanted to be just like him. A lot of people find it hard to believe, but at home, the coal train was a quiet man. Awesome. His introspection about the war kept me far from the military. He wanted more for me. That's what I fought for, baby. Dad said, one serum in education could do more to turn the tide of war than a single grunt with a gun ever could. You mentioned your degrees back when we first met. That's, uh, that's a lot to know for a kid. <laughs> yeah. Mom was always buying me books. Books for my birthday, books for special holidays. Had books out my ass. Interesting. No, oh, I loved it. I think it was a distraction to keep me away from what my dad was interested in. War? Sports. And I still don't want to talk about thrash ball. How'd you meet Hoffman? All right. Let's hope there's someone in here willing to help. Well, that all depends on how long their party's been going on. ain't a diplomatic mission anymore. Can someone turn off that damn radio? Hey, Bonnie. Take a look at this. All this imagery around a creature of some kind. Can you read the language? It's been a long time since Gran told me why Lehan. But I can try. Scroll references the awakening. It's the rite of passage she talked about. Listen. The mantle. A terror stalks and desires to consume. Let it be your burden, but let it not feed. The journey. Our ancestors carry you across the world. Their spirits guide and watch over you. Spirit walk. Enter the Fade and journey amongst the ancestors. The path of our people will reveal your burden. The fear. Awaken, reborn. Renewed, not consumed. Your heavy burden, transformed. Light as the feather. 
chase the creature. Ha! Huh. Looks like a big fucking bird. A bird? Feathers. Huh? Gran would tell me stories about the Wakatu, a flying demon that all children must face as a rite of passage. Are you suggesting that thing at the beach? Yes, the Wakatu isn't mythology. It's real. That's it. We track this Wakatu down and get a sample of its poison. Hey, after we figure out what's going on here, we'll find the villagers. Come on, Scorpio. Let's head into the village. This way. Damn, snipers. Shit. How the hell did those bastards get here? How are we gonna handle this? We kill the swarm. Every last one of them. Those are the pods here, though. They take them somewhere. A defensible structure. The temple up on the ridge. We can still save them. Let's go. You doing okay, Hannah? Ooh. Yeah, yeah. I'm good. We've got your back. That's right. Thanks, guys. Who needs it? Just hope we're not too late. Let's go. There are stories of people who survived being snatched and potted. But we need to be prepared for the reality that those chances are often slim. I'm not giving up on them. Let's get to the temple. This just doesn't make sense. Even the locusts couldn't grow between the islands. That's why Sanctum was built on Bohannon. How did they get to Walehi? I want to believe they're okay, but we can still help. Come on. Look, in the tree. We collected feathers from the Wakatu and brought them here. No pods, though. No bodies. <laughs> some kind of psychological effect. Makes you hear stuff, right? Stuff you'd rather not think about. Yeah. Yeah. 
But this incense, it's negating the toxic effects. We saw the same incense in the ritual room, back on Pahanu when we first landed. This proves that we can find the Wakatu. But right now, we need to find the villagers. Let's secure the village. Then, we can go hunting for that Wakatu of yours. One day too late. One day makes all the difference. They're gone. We couldn't save them. So, what the hell are we going to do about it? Make the fuckers pay! Now we're on the same page, sister. speed if he hears about this little outing. to good use, eh, Scorpio? We can't move it without power. Mac, this is all you. On it, Keegan. on their entire species. I still don't understand how they got here from Pahanu. Looks like we found an answer, Hannah. The lava tubes. This is how they got here. Lava tubes? Then maybe they're connecting the islands. Hannah, above you! I 
I can't handle? them, changed them. They wanted to change me too, Keegan. It's okay. You're safe now. We've got to signal tech. Let them know where we are. who survived being snatched. Huh. Yeah. The stories are true, huh? Still there, Scorpio? Stretcher incoming. Uh, sorry I got caught. Mess us all up. Uh, yeah. She's on, Tank! Take her up! Hey, you made it out. That's all that matters. It'll take me a bit to secure the stretcher. You guys good for a few? We'll manage. Thank goodness. Honestly, I can't believe she survived. But she did survive. What's on your mind? The Snatcher was taking Hana to the heart of the Hive. And we need a more efficient way to get there. Oh, no. You're not suggesting we let them capture us. Hold that thought! Swarm's here!
Clear! So, what do you think of my plan, eh? Operation Raid the Snatcher? You're serious. We get snatched up. Snatched up and smuggled right into the hive. Then what? There's no guarantee we can survive that. Fair point. But I feel like Hannah and her action science might have an answer for that. Hell. It might work. Get smuggled into the heart of the hive. But we still gotta get out of here first! More swarm on the ridge! And all of their fucking friends! Shit! <laughs> Block at him! Tuck, really use a lift. Carrying out. Hold on. Oh. About time. Good to go, Tuck. Quick work of the swarm. I feel good about Hannah's toxin plan. If we can manage to catch that thing. I'm not sure we can do it alone. Agreed. Now's the time to ask Hoffman to bring in some reinforcements. Keegan, this is not the point. What? What the hell are you talking about? Hoffman's gone rogue. It's just us. Colonel Hoffman is a decorated cog veteran. I would just think for a second. The access codes to Sanctum. If Hoffman's working with the cog, why couldn't he just get those codes himself? Doesn't make sense. Why would he lie to us? You think I join an actual cog mission? That man is used to doing whatever it takes to get the job done. Oh shit! This way! <laughs> Operation? Why would everything be so goddamn secret? When we got here, we had no clue where we were going. Next, not the time. Damn it! Knew we couldn't shake it for long. Minister rejected my plan to deal with the swarm. She said her damn robots could handle them. So I used my forced retirement to uh, launch a mission of my own. All this time, we were on a goddamn rogue operation? That's right. Look, I know your past. That you've all suffered and struggled, but you've still got that fight in you. Purpose. That's why we're here. 
It was our lives on the line. The fate of the entire planet is on the line, soldier. I'm not here to save the world. The swarm took my son. Dragged him, screaming into the dark. I failed to protect him. To fight for him. I joined up to make these fuckers pay. And I planned to die doing it. But here we are. So, to hell with it. I'll live. And I'll fight for what family I have left. I won't stand by and watch more people suffer. Not when I can do something about it. We know how to get to the heart of the hive. All I need is one sample. And you'll get it. But I won't let my brother face this one alone. Wish I could have been there for you, Mac. And your son. But I'm here now. Well, that's it then. Once more into the screaming dark. ancestors have done for generations. Enter the Fade and walk amongst the ancestors. The path of our people will reveal your burden. There's our path. I'll be down. The Awakening. The Wakatu. I'm leaving out what my parents and grand used to believe was mythology. Just stories. I was in prison when grand passed. Wish you could see me now. It's none of my business, but... It's okay. We're squad now. You both should know. I fucked up. Deliberately ignored an order. Thought I knew better than everyone else, and someone got killed. I see you. A good man. The truth is, as much as I want to go back, I don't know if there's a spot waiting for me. I know that feeling. Sometimes there ain't no going back. And I'm learning that might be okay. Lonnie, what's this? Some kind of effigy. My father used to call pieces by like from wood. Said they would protect us from dark spirits. Being back in the action. Having a team at my side. I've missed this feeling of being part of something bigger. I know that feeling too. This way. Give me a hand. Locust cleanup crew. Cleanup crew? Some of the locusts survived the war. We made them disappear. Quietly. So, the emulsion countermeasure at Azura. As far as the public knows, the war ended there. But there was still more work to be done. <laughs> 
Stationed on Azura, doing basically guard duty. Onyx exiles, they call us. No glory, no rank, and no purpose. For all those years. I'm sorry. I don't know about all this rank stuff, but what you're doing here, this matters, brother. Thanks. I uh, appreciate that. That's all of them. The way out is ahead. Through those doors. <laughs> Ammo deployed. Did you say children used to walk this path? Well, they weren't. the Wakatu's nest. Then we're still on the right path. You know, before all this, I really thought my life was over. That I'd live out the rest of my days in prison. So you joined up when half Crony found you, hmm? Exactly. Same here. What else can you do when you've lost everything? Oh, see. That's a whole damn vulture. A vulture went down on Pahanu? You found 144B. It went down shortly before I arrived on Galangi. It was loaded with the initial DB force to lead our charge into the bunker. Think we could recruit them to our cause? Worth a shot? gonna run into more DBs from that vulture. <laughs> Stupid bot. Tell me about it. But, but I wouldn't have given for their help when the swarm attacked my village. What happened? A slaughter. Then the terrifying quiet. Even if I wasn't miles from home, I couldn't have stopped it. I wasn't a fighter. You did what you could, Mac, and you lived. 
If I wasn't such a coward, I would have died with him. Coward? Show me a man sacrificing more than one who's lost their child. I'd follow you into any fight. Thank you. Both of you. Ready to block up. Let's keep moving. Through here. Blade, good to go. <clears throat> This river goes right to the Wakatu's nest. And look at that. There is a board waiting for us. Hey, lucky, right? <laughs> you know it. Ammo deployed. It's been one hell of a journey, that's for sure. I only got this far thanks to your support. Uh, gotta admit, I was wrong about you, Mac. We both were. Well, I had my assumptions about you two as well. Look at us now! Team Scorpio, saving the planet! <laughs> <laughs> you know, my grand's final words to me were about struggle. How my suffering could define the true life. The weak, the strong. I wanted to know which I'd be. She said, live and discover for yourself. That's the journey. I think I would have liked it. It doesn't matter how hard we tried to run from our past. Everything we did led us here. Led us to this island. A thousand miles from the war. This time I'm gonna make a goddamn difference. I thought this was my chance to prove myself. To the Brash Brigade. To the memory of my CO. My gran was right. The path of my life to determine who I become. You brought me home. Here. And gave me a new family. That was You survived a hell of a lot to find home, Scorpio. I say we fight like hell to save it. Looks like this is it. Fear. The Wakatu wants to swarm off this island as much as we do. We should try to get the sample without killing it. Agreed. Be good to see the natural order restored. But he might have other plans.
Put up one hell of a fight. You, uh, think it'll live? Yeah, I do. It's a good day. Everyone survives. you to know. It's your fault, and I'm gonna fucking haunt you. How's your nerves, Major How? Oh, to hell with my anxiety. This time, I'm the surprise. See you on the other side. 